Let's talk about control. And first and foremost, I'm talking about control body odor and that's anywhere. And all you have to do is shop.mando and get $5 off of your starter pack. And that's over 40% with promo code LAW shopmando.com. Let's go. This is my routine. I use this body wash odor control. Yes, indeed. Full body control with Mando. They have the product here and they also have deodorant that you apply under the arm for 72 hours of odor control you want to be in control and speaking of control they also have the product that you can apply all over the body the invisible cream and it also fights for 72 hours look it's all about being in control and with mando man they control body odor anywhere all you have to do is shop.mando get five dollars off your starter pack that's over 40 percent with promo code law shopmando.com let's go and let's stay in control of your order i love it let's look into the film in this video we will be looking at trey lance the quarterback for the cowboys now and i'm not going to beat him up he is a guy that flourish off of play actions uh he is a guy that you would need to uh have play action involved into the game and that is to bring the inside guys in and uh also with that i believe he do have the arm talent to get the ball out to the edges or what have you He's very raw in the sense, but I look at it that he's athletic as well, though. When you look at all of his skill sets and accolades right here, you look at the, the ability to throw the ball and sling it down the field. That comes from uh, the running game, and that's what run game brings to the table. And he's able to put that ball right on the number. And look, run game brings inside the linebackers here to allow Trey to go through his progressions here or one progression here to throw it to the open man and Debo did the rest here on that particular rep and that's what you can get out of a Trey Lance he brings in the run action the run ability to keep plays alive and his play action goes down the field try to missile that ball in there great progression there that was the two read there but you know uh the defender got there before he's able to get there ball out and he's able to take this third down play and get a first down by running keeping the play alive there and now he's warming up so trey lance do have the escape ability he got a strong arm uh, i truly believe that that you would need a a good run game with him so that you can have better reads on the outside the one-on-ones or what have you and he do have the mobile ability to move out on the edge here just ball just bat it down uh here's a three by one formation again and dance around in the pocket don't like what he sees this, this was another third down here and he's able to get the positive yards out of it and when you look at trey lance escape abilities there that's what you're going to get now granted this video was did in 2021 and he advanced since that time frame in my opinion uh he got better mechanics now i think that mike mccarthy been working on him tremendously Keep in mind, he was only 21 at this time of this game. He's approaching right at 23, 24 now. So he's a little bit wiser, been in the system, seeing things a little bit better. It's just that his the read is not there. Uh, he's going to take it, tuck it, and run it. And there's nothing wrong with that. In my opinion, you know, live to fight another day. Don't force anything inside or uh, on the outer edges here. And we are seeing that he's able to do just that. And they spread him right here. Pressure's in the face. Look to get downfield. And he, he throws the ball and hit his uh, underneath guy. That's what you got to do when they play in those cloud cover type of styles of uh, defenses there and he made them pay off of this one I, I like that so if they're going to play him deep he can run it underneath and a little refinery here you know uh, I think that Quandre Diggs he did a great job of uh, baiting him into this throw right here and he trusts his arm Trey do trust his arm to get that ball inside there and you see right here climb the pocket here and just the dude just made a real good jump and play on the ball just real good play on the ball Debo should have came down with it or, or 15 whoever that may be the wide receiver there let me see who that is who that is yeah Debo yeah 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 you know better than this you know fight through nose the ball come back to the ball or what have you 
but a good play by the, the safety there. That's why safeties do matter. <laughs> and Diggs was able to jump down inside on that. All right, so three step and the ball was just a little low, a little skipper there. But, you know, the receiver did come back for it, you know. And we're looking at this right here. Yes, that's a real quick read here. Um, he's going to attempt the throw that I'm going to really like, even though uh, I, I truly believe that the tight end should have came down with the ball. But I do like this run play right here when they tried to play zone, that he was able to run the ball, keep the defense playing honest. And that could be play calling right there, trusting, fumbled on a snap here. But he's able to get the ball and just get positive yards out of it. All right, so this is um, missile in and down inside. They playing off coverage, so he's just taking what the defense is giving him, throwing it a good check down underneath. And right here, just throw the ball away. Don't take the sack here. I, I like that strong enough for him to get the ball out of bounds there and beyond the LOS. He drops back here. He missed this ball down inside. I, I would say this. <laughs> Jake Ferguson catching that, you know, <laughs> but I'm saying this though, uh, Kittle's great play, great read right here. When you're looking at this kind of caliber of defense, you know, for sure, they're giving you the middle of the field. You just got to hold the safety here. And Trey is able to, to miss this ball right inside in between the numbers here. That's a touchdown. That's something that you can really say to yourself, man, you want that. And you love it when you see it, right? So that's potentials. That's missling the ball in. Kittles should have came down with the ball, but he catched the pill. Yeah, get that hit right there. Make him pay 33. Uh, and six was right there. This was when Adams and Diggs was in the backfield. So uh, my brother called him Trigger Trey. And Trey will pull the trigger on you. And that is what you can see out of his game play right here. Uh, move feet. Keep your feet active. Get some positive yards off of it. Make them pay for playing that zone defense. Don't force anything. This is what I love about Trey Lance here. You see they playing deep coverages right here. They pretty much saying, okay, hey, right now the 49ers is behind in this game. They got to throw themselves back in it, right? And what he's going to do here is not going to force the ball into the flat here. You're not going to get the ball right here. He's seeing that these two defenders are there. He want to get more. You want to see where this to play develop. If he's going to stick and stand still right here, he maybe stick this guy. Let's see how it play out here. Uh, deep hook route. He don't like what he sees. Even though he's well in his hand, this is a bait right here because he really to pick that off. So he really had nowhere to go with this outside of savaging it and getting minimal yards. But hey, trust his legs, trust what he sees, get the ball upfield by his legs, you know. So there's more than one way to scan a cat, get the first down, get down, you know. So that's what I like about his skill set and his game. He's able to run the ball and make him pay. And this swing pass right here. To Debo, Debo do the rest. Debo live off of those uh, situations. Let me look at his swing again. You know, I always love the 49er play calling when they when they put Debo in motion. And if they can't get things going positively, they make sure make it their business to get Debo active and watch. Uh, he's going to look at that one read there. And it's just a design play right here. Block hat on hat. Get there, blocker. Get there. Debo going to figure out the rest. He just squeezes down in there. Bully the other guys. He makes sure to get those uh, points there. Uh, I like Debo and that aspect of it. And this is what we all like right here. The ability for the quarterback to run it in himself for the uh, extra two points right here. Just great. Great play design right here. Look, you don't have to overanalyze everything. You see that they don't have a loaded box here where they have it loaded, but it's spread out. So they've been in the past, as you guys can see. And boom, hat on hat, 75 pool. Yeah, yeah, that's how you get in there. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is the quarterback in waiting for the Cowboys. I would tell you guys, in order to get the full capacity of a Trey Lance, you would have to have some run game. Yeah, I think that he flourished better when it's play action, when they have the fear to run. You see when they load in the box or what have you. And the good other part of it is that even if they drop people in coverage or what have you, he, he's not going to force it, force it inside double and triple coverages because then that's when he's going to run the ball. 
So you're going to have to have a spy on him. He's athletic enough. He's six foot four. He's a good frame, got a strong arm. He can get the ball out to the edges there and he will make you pay. He's still got youth on his side, right? He's 23 going on 24. So he's still got youth on his side. And I think that he's going to be a guy that when you look into training camp, that a lot of people are going to say, hey, this dude got an arm. Hey, this dude is athletic. With some refinery here on some of his throws, I think that you got something out of him. But neither here nor there. Uh, Cowboy Nation, post me your thoughts, post me your concerns down below. That's been my time. I really thank you all for yours. And remember, you're listening to nothing but the best. Let's get it.